Hello and welcome to the next chapter in the exciting book called the Minecraft Weekly News. Your authors Toby and David take you through a wonderful world of news and happenings starting with these tweets. Carnalizer focuses on the bigger, bigger issues, Mark realises his mistake in gaming and Notch has himself a jolly old time. Let's read on to some newsy things. August 1st saw the new End User Licence Agreement or EULA come into effect, and this week servers have been running under those terms, many with changed in-game shops to comply with the rules on real currency exchange for in-game items and play to win balancing. Mark highlighted the Hypixel server as a shining example, as since the old EULA was being debated, the Hypixel team has been working tirelessly to ease themselves, the server and their community into the new system, complying whilst innovating to maintain fairness, yet keeping up development and expensive server monetization. Fair play to all involved. This week's snapshot, 14W32, is the very definition of feature creep, as the development team has not only been squashing, crushing and quashing bugs, but also adding lots of lovely content. First up, the armor stand, a long requested feature in Minecraft, which can be crafted using six sticks and any stone slab like so. Armor can then be added to it by right clicking or using a dispenser. Mob heads and pumpkins can be added as well. Also added is red sandstone, which takes four red sand to be made and can be crafted into chiseled, smooth, stair and slab forms. There are changes to beacons as well, as light beams can now be coloured when passing through stained glass and stained glass panes. The coolest part is that if you use multiple coloured glass blocks, the colours will merge in the most psychedelic way. Finally, and we know this is the most highly awaited feature ever, coarse dirt can now be tilled in order to make normal dirt. Yeah. This week in Awesome though, we've got something teaser-like from Mojang themselves. Although not included in this week's snapshot, there was a teaser shot of more types of wooden fences and gates. Let's hope we see them next week, or at least in update 1.8. Also this week, YouTuber Doc M has utilised a new armour stand in an incredible way, making a mini android Doc M. The mini me can walk, change direction, and mine and attack his way along a given path. It's an incredible use of the new feature, made all the more impressive by the speed that the use was figured out. We'll leave the link to that video down below. If there's two things I love in this world, it's smiley faces and the Minecraft forums. So I weed a little bit when I found out I could combine the two even more, as throughout August there's a create the smiley competition going on. The MC forum guys are choosing their 20 favourite designs from the submissions, which will then be voted on. So head down to the link below to make your own happy or sad face. Well, that's the end of this little story. I hope you enjoyed the fight scene on page 150. If you want to read more of our video, then click up here for last week's news video, and up here for the wiki video on the Elder Guardian. Mm. We'll be hanging around on the Twitters all week, and you can subscribe to stay abreast of all our latest releases. We'll see you next week for more exciting and newsworthy chatting.